name is Frank Everett, and welcome to Frank's Files. Welcome to Sotheby's Jewelry. I am thrilled today to talk to you about a very special collection that we'll be selling here at Sotheby's. The collection of Marjorie S. Fisher will be on the block this December 8th, and we'll be selling more than a thousand pieces of her encyclopedic collection from now until the end of next year. Mrs. Fisher had exquisite taste and style. She really had a passion for jewelry and understood a lot about the makers and the periods that she purchased. And she also had the true mind of a collector, which means a collection is never really finished. So let me show you a couple of pieces that are my favorites. We have to start with the cover lot of Mrs. Fisher's sale. This is an extremely beautiful and rare brooch by Frank Cleef and Arpels, 1937 mystery set rubies. It's easy to see why they chose to put it on the cover. We always say at Sotheby's, every great collection is anchored by an important diamond ring, and Mrs. Fisher's collection had two. This very interesting elongated emerald cut ring mounted by Graf is more than 16 carats. A perfect marquise, more than 18 carats, D color, and VBS clarity with the potential to be internally flawless. All right, now let's move on to some of her favorite designers. Schlumberger has to be at the top of the list, one of Mrs. Fisher's favorites, and certainly one of mine. The tulip necklace, and the gazelle, one of my favorite little brooches. She also loved Verdora. We love Verdora. Let's see what I have here. Of course, no collection is complete without Verdura Maltese cross cuffs. Another maker that's really prominent in the collection, Van Cleef and Arpels. This beautiful Minotier, all gem set with emeralds, rubies, and diamonds. Another interesting suite over here, signed by M. Garrard. Fabulous design from the 70s. Beautiful necklace, earrings, and bracelet with these circles of diamonds set in gold. Really, really glamorous. And the last thing I'm gonna show you are two pieces by Rene Boivin. This one, beautifully articulated butterfly. The wings all move. This collection of three brooches, these were formerly in the collection of the ever stylish Babe Paley. Well, I hope you've enjoyed seeing just a small taste of the Fisher collection. I could go on and on, and I probably will, because we have, as I said, more than a thousand pieces of this collection to sell over the coming year. It's very exciting. This group will go on exhibition on December 3rd, and we'll be selling the collection on December 8th. We also have a sale on December 9th of Fine Jewels, so please come to our exhibition and you can try all of it on.